A bye week coming at the perfect time for the UNA Lions as they recover from multiple injuries and from a rough start. Yesterday, the Lions returned home for a Big South battle with Charleston Southern. All right, of course, they've been playing well at Brawley Stadium, but could they keep it up? On their first possession, they're driving down the field. Christian Lopez hands it off to Terrence Humphrey. He picks up great yardage, getting the Lions closer to the end zone, but the drive would stall, and they would have to settle for a field goal. A 30 yarder by Joe Gurley is up, and it is good. Buccaneers now on the offensive attack. Jack Chambers, not a bad last name. Oh, huh, yeah. <laughs> Fires it across the middle, and it's the Lions' Jalen Dredd, who's all over that. And next thing you know, he's the lucky recipient of a pick six. 62 yards for the score, and UNA is up in this game. Well, they extend their lead in this contest. Now, the Buccaneers finally getting on the board as Alex Ursi hits a 24-yard field goal, making it 11-3. You do not see that score no. commonly scored in most games. Lions back in the offense attack. Lopez, this time in the pocket, launches Ooh. the downfield, but it is picked off by Gerard Stanley. He will return at 17 yards for the Buccaneers. That would set up this. Chambers throws it to Garris Swarting. That's what I'm going to say his last name is. For the touchdown in the end zone at the half, it is 13-11, another unusual score. <laughs> Third quarter, Lions coming out hot on their first drive. Once again, it is Terrence Humphrey bulldozing his way into the end zone. Like, get off of me as I score right here, everybody. Lions take the lead of 17 to 16 at that point, but Charleston Southern gets the last hoorah in this one. They come to Florence and beat UNA last night by final of 25 to 20. It's just kind of the way the makeup of this team is right now. I, you know, there's no, if I knew the answer to that, we'd have it fixed and we would be a different. But, you know, right now that's kind of been our team. One half looks better than the other half. Defense can't get a stop when we need to stop. You know, uh, offense can't score when we need to score, but then they score and then we turn. It just, it, it's been that way all year. So as Coach 